What's up, YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, we're going to talk about how that bomber jacket should fit. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every day at 4 p.m. Eastern discussing various men's lifestyle topics such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe and tap that notification bell and join us. And to my returning friends, like Matthias Salou, salute. Now we all know how classic and versatile the bomber jacket is. It's just an essential staple that looks good on almost any guy out there. But just like with any wardrobe piece, it's very important that that bomber jacket fit just right. It's not that complicated, but there's a few things you gotta pay attention to to make sure it's perfect though. So in today's video, I just wanted to give you a quick tutorial to make sure that bomber jacket fits right on you. There's five key areas I need you to pay attention to, and I'm gonna break each one of them down, starting right now. Now first off, just like with any jacket, I don't care if you're talking about a bomber jacket, suit jacket, straight jacket, it doesn't matter. The most important area to make sure it fits, those shoulders. If your bomber jacket doesn't fit right in the shoulders, just put it back. It's a lost cause, start all over. So how do you know if it fits in your shoulders? Very easy, this is all you have to do. The simple way to know if that jacket fits in the shoulders, pay attention to the shoulder seam. Here's what I mean. The shoulder seam should fall exactly where your shoulder ends and your arm begins. That simple. If the shoulder seam is above that area, the jacket's too small. If the shoulder seam falls below that area, the jacket's too big. Put it back, grab a smaller size. Now for our second area, I want you to pay attention to how it fits in your torso slash body. Now there's several types of bomber jackets. Some guys like to wear them a little bigger. But I don't suggest that. It can kind of swallow you up, make you look, look too small if you're a small guy, or make you look too big if you're a bigger guy. Instead, go for something a little more fitted in the chest and the waist. Now, how do you know if it fits well? Very simple. I got what I like to call the pinch test. As you see I'm doing here, pinch the sides of the jacket. You should be able to grab about an inch or two of fabric. If you can grab more than that, the jacket's too big. If you grab less than an inch, the jacket's a little too tight, go up a size. And in addition to that, when you zip the jacket up, you want it to have a little bit of a V taper, giving your shoulders a little broadness and your waist looking a little slimmer. That's one of the great things of a nice fitted bomber jacket. Now the third area I want you to pay attention to to make sure that bomber jacket is fitting right, the waist area. A bomber jacket is usually cut more cropped than other jackets might be. So here's where you want it to fall. You want the waist of the jacket to fall right around the top of your pants maybe even a little higher. Give it a nice cropped look. Unless you're trying to be a little bit more trendy and you want a more of a long line look, I suggest you make sure that waist area right around the top of the trousers and the pants, give me that cropped look and a great bomber jacket fit. Now for our fourth area you need to look at for that bomber jacket fit, I'm gonna to switch to a more traditional look for this one. We're gonna talk about the collar. Now the collar in a bomber jacket usually has like this little knitted material that contrasts to the rest of the jacket. On top of that, it comes a little bit up the neckline for a little bit of protection and it frames your neck and face. So what you wanna pay attention to, you definitely want that collar to extend up a little bit on the front and the side. That way the contrast is noted and it gives you a little bit more warmth and protection in nippy weather. And last but certainly not least, let's talk about how that sleeve should fit on your bomber jacket. Now traditionally, on a bomber jacket, the end of the sleeves have a nice little knitted cuffed area. That cuffed area should fit nice and snug around your wrist. On top of that, it should fall right at the wrist bone area. That lets you know the jacket's sleeves length are proper. If you have that nice snug fit around the cuffs and it falls right on that wrist bone, you know that bomber jacket's the right size for you. Okay, so there you have it. My quick five step tutorial to make sure your bomber jacket fits properly. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, hit that like button, it helps the channel to grow. And of course, tap that notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos we release every day at 4 p.m. Eastern. And I'll check you out tomorrow.